Hello everyone welcomes to my sister wives today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Robin Brown of Sister Wives lied when she claimed not to be aware of Cody Brown's conflicts with other wives. The Brown family of Sister Wives was portrayed by TLC as a harmonious community of adults and kids who coexisted as a single, efficient polygamist household. But the clan has proven to be anything but as the seasons have changed. Although Cody said he kept private information about his relationships with each of his wives, in the UK version of the TLC series, Cody is shown to have lied to viewers by asking Robin for counsel regarding his marriage to Christine Brown and her, while also pretending she was unaware of his difficulties. Cody and Robin Brown's relationship progressed from a spiritual union to a formal marriage. After that, he started spending so much time at her house that he lost interest in his previous relationships and they became monogamous. A video of Cody sitting down with Robin to discuss his relationship with Christine prior to their spiritual divorce has been uploaded to TLC's UK YouTube account. After hearing his version of the tale, she offers her own relationship counsel. Without a crystal ball, a YouTube channel broke the initial news on this story. Cody tells Robin he's going to have a conversation with Christine at her place. Does everything seem okay to her? After that, Cody tells Robin private information about his marriage to Christine. Cody says to Robin, she says to me, I don't want you to stay here anymore. I was stunned, almost in disbelief. My belongings were all outside the room when I was in the garage. Cody went on, my clothes and books are in boxes. Robin's recommendations? Unless they managed to sort things out, sleep on the couch. But since Cody preferred to live at Robin's house and avoided spending time with his spouses, why would Robin assume his three other marriages would last? This is when she seems to fib, seeming perplexed, but also disclosing a lot more information than she probably expected. During a confessional, in the same video, Robin Brown pretended not to know about Cody and Christine Brown's marital difficulties. But how could Robin not know that Cody was neglecting his other three wives, Christine, Mary, and Janelle, given that he was spending all of his time at her place? According to Robin, I was just shocked. She revealed that she was aware of tension in each and every one of Cody's relationships during the coronavirus pandemic, COVID-19, for different reasons in the sentence that followed. She goes on, I knew there was conflict between him and Christine. However, I assumed it was only because they couldn't agree on how to handle COVID. Robin expressed her hope that things will turn out okay. She then mentioned his ongoing problems with Mary and Janelle. For this reason, Robin claimed she didn't see it coming when she found out Christine had thrown Cody out of her bedroom. As a result, Robin seemed to be much more knowledgeable of Cody's connections with the other three women in his life than she had previously disclosed. She pretended not to know why their relationships ended in divorce. Robin Brown talked about how, despite being married to other people, she ended up becoming Cody's primary wife during the 2022 Sister Wives, one-on-one -on -one special. About her sister wives, Robin recalled, they handed him to me and said, we don't want to spend time with him, basically. In part, Cody declined to respond when asked in that same series episode if Robin was his favorite wife. That's the most unfair question, you know, because you have no idea what kind of work, Robin, has done, what kind of person she has been, what sacrifices she has made, and what games she hasn't played, he says. The reality star makes a distinction between the woman who finds favor with him and his favorite wife. It isn't a matter of preference. Finding favor is the key, he argues. The language Christine uses makes Robin the target of hostility. She was just kind to Christine, she never did anything to her. Then, Cody says that Robin hasn't s asterisk 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 talked to him since they got married, but Mary, Janelle, and Christine have. He says, as far as I know, Robin puts up her dukes if you s asterisk 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 talk me. Star of Sister Wives, Janelle Brown, shares what happened to her late son, Garrison's cats after his passing. Even though Garrison Brown is no longer with us, his cherished kitties have found new homes. Last month, the son of Sister Wife star Janelle Brown and her ex-husband, Cody Brown, committed suicide. 
He left behind three rescued kittens, one of whom he had acquired a few days prior to his passing. On Sunday, Janelle shared the last destiny of her son's cherished pets on Instagram. The TLC personality shared pictures of the pets in their new homes along with a statement, saying, Garrison's cats, Catthu and Patches, are thriving at Logan and Michelle's place and Ms. Boots is living her best life with Aspen and Mitch. It was awesome that we could continue to take care of them like he would. Aspen Thompson is the daughter of Janelle's sister-wife, Christine Brown, and Cody, while Logan Brown is the son of Janelle and Cody. Before he passed away, Garrison shared on Instagram the addition of Ms. Buttons to his house. Ms. Buttons is the newest addition to my house. She was on the verge of death at the age of nine, but my hero complex was insufficient to save her. He posted, hashtag crazycatlity, six days prior to his passing. Following Garrison's passing, supporters showered local cat rescue centers in Flagstaff, Arizona with love-filled donations. One such center, High Country Humane, got $13,000 in tribute to Garrison. Last month, Janelle wrote on Instagram in response to fan donations, saying, I'm crying all over again. I'm receiving information on all of the gifts made on behalf of Garrison, to at High Country Humane at our cat sanctuary. I am grateful for everyone's kindness. It has immense meaning. He was very attached to the animals he adopted from both agencies. He was a happy cat father. Following a self-inflicted gunshot wound, Garrison was discovered dead last month. Since then, the divided Brown family has reunited for a military funeral in his memory. Janelle and Cody, who were spiritually married from 1993 until 2022, had four children together with Garrison, Logan, 29, Madison, 28, Hunter, 27, Gabriel, 22, and Savannah, 19. Following Christine, Janelle, and Mary Brown's separation from Cody, the Brown family has become more distant in recent times. Friction has also arisen between the former polygamist and his elder children regarding Cody's relationship with Robin Brown, his sole surviving wife, and his alleged partiality toward her. On Sister Wives, this was extensively explored, especially his strained connection with his kids, Gabriel and Garrison. In November 2023, A.T. had a conversation with Janelle and Christine on Cody's distance from certain members of his family. According to Janelle, Cody wished to improve his relationship with his children. On March 5th, Garrison was found dead in his home in Flagstaff, Arizona. Since then, Maddie has opened up several times about how she is coping with the difficult situation. In her recent Instagram update, she shared that in November 2023, she started focusing on gratitude after she became curious about its profound effects on our well-being. The insights I gained were nothing short of astounding, revealing how a simple practice could significantly alter our emotional landscape, she wrote. Then came Garrison's unexpected death last month.